it's Allie here from Allie'sBlog.ca. So I have a new um, review for you today. I am going to be reviewing the She Modern Sparkling Nail Glitters. Um, these are not the same as the ones that I did before. Tina from She Modern actually has reinvented all of her nail glitters and is doing them in a different way. Um, so there's lots of different new ones. I think the old ones have been taken out and are no longer available so there are the new glitters. Um, but I think they're like all similar colors or there's new colors and stuff like that. So I was sent these um, by Tina from She Modern. So I did not purchase these myself but I will always give an honest review and I will definitely tell you what I think of these glitters whether I like them or not. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to tell you how to use them and then what comes in the package and all that great stuff. Alright, so I just took them out of the package. Um, so I'm going to be trying out two glitters today. I have the Translucent Pixie Red and the Translucent Pixie Rainbow. So I'm going to be trying out the Pixie um, powder. So there are a bunch of different Pixie ones. There's Pixie Blue, Pixie Gold, Pixie Green, um, Pixie Rainbow, and Pixie Silver. So I have two of the Pixie ones. Um, so I'm going to be trying out these particular glitters. So I'll tell you what comes in um, the package. So you get the glitter here and then you get a little nail um, to do your swatch on there. So I already did that one, um, but I'm going to show you um, later on what it looks like. Um, so you get the little bottle of the glitter. Um, it's three grams by the looks of it. And then it comes with this actually is an empty bottle. So there's nothing in here. Um, the point of this is to actually clean your brush. So you can either use... Um, like nail brush cleaner or um, acetone works as well so if you don't have nail brush cleaner you can always use acetone um, so then it comes with this little like pamphlet and inside mine came with actually more she modern stickers so that's really really cute um, I'm getting a bunch of stickers which is nice because I haven't tried all of them yet um, so in this one it came with these I haven't seen that little girl one that was cute and then it has another one on the side so if you can try them with your nail design. So I'm not actually going to use the stickers today. I'm just going to use the powder or the glitters. Um, so that's what came in that one. I'll show you the stickers that came in the other one. This is always nice to see them. Um, and then it also comes with this mixing canvas. So that's trying to um, like either put under the actual um, glitter so that you don't make a big mess or you can use it to mix. There's a bunch of different ways to actually apply this glitter. I'm just going to show you the one way in this particular video and then when I do another version of this glitter I will show you another way how to do it. So I'm just going to show you the other stickers I got in the other one. So I got some more heart and flowers and then I got some stocking and some cupid ones. So very cute stickers. I really like her stickers. I think they're really nice. So if you haven't tried them yet, I would definitely recommend them. So those are the stickers that were included in this one. So they're samples. So it's kind of a nice way to try them and then see what you like and stuff like that. So those are some of them. But yeah, so we're going to go ahead and get started on the nail design. So right now on my nails, I have some white and black base and then I topped it off with my no cleanse um, gel top coat so I'm doing gel nails today I believe you can do these with um, regular nail polish as well but I'm gonna be doing all gel nails today um, and then I will do probably another later on video that with just like regular polish so you can get how it works so we're gonna go ahead and get started all right so first off I'm gonna start with the translucent pixie rainbow one and that is what it looks like it's like really pretty it's kind of like a white kind of glitter um so i'm gonna do it on one white nail and then one black nail so you can see what it looks like um so the way i'm gonna do this one is i'm just gonna apply the glitter on my nail first and it just kind of squirts out and then i'm gonna use um, the nail polish to kind of like smooth it over so this is one way of doing this and then you just kind of smooth it over your nail. And if you want to add more glitter, you definitely can. I think I might add it a little bit more to the edge. Because I don't think I got it everywhere. It's 
So if you are happy with the look, then you can be done with that. So now we're going to move on to the black nail. So we're going to do the same thing. I'm just going to put it on. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and cure that one. First, I'm just going to kind of clean up around the edges a little bit just because this is gel nails and I don't really want all that to stay. So I'm going to go ahead and cure those and I'll be right back. So I'm going to move on to the other color. So that means I'm going to use my little nail brush cleanser. So I have um, just nail brush cleaner and I'm just going to pop a little bit of it in there and then you just kind of mix it around with your brush in there so that you don't get glitter. Sorry, you're supposed to wipe it first. I should probably have <laughs> done that. Sorry, I am trying this the first time. Um, so you wipe your brush a little bit and then you put it in there. And then you just kind of move it around in there and your brush is clean. So that is nice. So you don't put that glitter back into um, your nail polish bottle. Because I find I do that a lot with powders and I end up getting a clean, a sparkly top coat out of the end of it. Um, and then you can also just wipe off this here. I'm just going to use the same one um, anyways because I'm just going to do the red glitter next. So now we are moving on to Pixie Red um, and this is kind of like a red tinge to it. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to apply it the same way to that the white nail. And again I'm mixing it with Alright, and I'm going to go ahead and cure those. Alright, so that is the finished designs. I think they actually turned out really pretty. Um, I think I like them over the white better than I do the black because it kind of shows, um, like I kind of, this one's a little bit more patchy, but I think they turned out really nice. So I'm definitely impressed with them. Um, I'm actually thinking I like the red better than um, the rainbow one because it kind of gives like a pink kind of shimmer to your nails so it's actually really really nice and I like the fact that on the actual bottles you can put like a swatch so that's pretty cool but yeah so that's all I have for today